The women's tennis team claims the A-Sun regular season title. Meanwhile, the baseball team sweeps Stetson. All that and more on this edition of Monday Minutes on Osprey Sports Network. Ospreys, I'm Catherine Marsh. The baseball team hosted Stetson over the weekend and dominated the series. In game one, they scored four runs before winning six to two. In game two, they won five to three, and in the final game, they blanked the Hatters, winning five to zero. They will host a midweek game against UCF on Tuesday, then travel to Savannah State for a game on Wednesday. The softball team went across town this weekend and squared off against JU. They lost the first game 4-0. In game two, they were down by as much as seven runs before they rallied to tie the score 15-all. JU then scored on a bunt single to win the series. In the series finale on Sunday, they fell to JU 9-8. They will host Bethune-Cookman in a doubleheader on Thursday with the first game starting at 4 p.m. The women's tennis team won their second straight regular season title with their win over Stetson. They won 5-2 with reigning A-Sun Women's Tennis Player of the Week, Katsali Vasquez, clinching the victory and the regular season conference title. This capped off an undefeated conference record going 6-0. The Ospreys earned a bye for the first round of the A-Sun Women's Tennis Championship. They will play the winner of the 4-5 versus five matchup Saturday in Spartanburg. The men's tennis team also beat Stetson and had much to celebrate as well. They won 5-2 with Lasse Mushaitis getting the win to clinch the match. They finish second in the conference and earn a first round bye in the A-Sun Men's Tennis Championship. They'll play the winner of Stetson and Kennesaw State this Saturday. The beach volleyball team closed out their regular season with a couple of tough losses. At the Florida State duels, they fell to UAB 5-0 but dropped the next three matches. They will now head to Cartersville, Georgia for the A-Sun Beach Volleyball Championship this Friday. The track and field team competed in two meets this weekend, highlighted by a plethora of personal records. A total of 23 personal records were set, including Bobby Harris's 7-foot, 2.5-inch high jump, setting the school record and winning the competition. They also had 13 top five finishes. Next up, the team will go to Gainesville for the Tom Jones Memorial on Friday. In action this week, the men's golf team is in Brazelton, Georgia, competing for the A-Sun Conference title. After Sunday's first round, they sit third in the standings. Well, that's all we have for you on this edition of Monday Minutes. For all of us here at Osprey Sports Network, I'm Katherine Marsh. Have a great week and go Ospreys.